Super swole I like it. I like it. Alright, he's got a long ass big thing. Beer time. I'm guessing we can't just go back into the past and scrap the androids there, right? Right. It's likely that anything we do in that timeline won't affect this one. Man, there's no easy way out of this, huh? I'll win, you'll see. Oh, God. something in particular there it is no one stands in the way of peace wait does trunks uh trunks oh shit level you up buddy Not that I can unlock any of your shit because I need dick medals, but at least get you a little strong. Wait, no house, heavy blow, supreme power, destructive blow. Your, your your solar flare shit to destroy the androids and sell here they're still going to exist in your future am i right yeah but if goku and the others can figure out their weaknesses here i can go back to my I think this is it yeah so should we just go ahead and blow it up not yet we should head down there and see what we can find first we might be able to discover something about how to defeat the androids Ah, right. Then let's make our way inside. Skull and Trunks checked both the interior and underground facilities <gasps> at the left. Afterwards, they destroyed the entire lab in order to present itself and fully developing. 
did it. Right. Now Cell won't be a problem in this timeline. Just kidding. And now we got an ace up our sleeve. Good call saying we should dig around the lab. I didn't think we'd actually be able to find the blueprints for Android 17 and 18. If we show these to my mother, she should be able to figure out how we can defeat them. True. Actually, would you mind taking this to my mother for me? I have something I need to do. Huh? You're not coming? No. I thought I'd do some training with my father. If he's able to go beyond Super Saiyan, then I should too with proper training. Well, Vegeta's not exactly a team player. He probably won't want to train with you. You may be right. But sparring with someone leads to greater results in a short amount of time. Even my father should know that. It's worth a shot, at least. Right. Sounds like you know what you're doing. Reading you loud and clear. Good luck! Thanks. Random numbers of XP. Then, Trunks sought out his father, Vegeta, while Krillin made his way to Bulma to deliver the blueprints. Impressed and terrified by Dr. Jiro's genius, Bulma searched for the android's weakness. First two, and then three days had passed. Piccolo and the others, using Kame House as their base, continued their hunt for Cell, but to no avail. They could do nothing but watch as news of more victims spread. A monster has made its way to a town in South District 48. Half the residents are gone. Hmm. So he's made his way south. Well, come on! We might still be able to catch him if we leave now. Good luck! Don't die. That cell creep sure is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, did everyone leave? Go on too? Great so. Go on. Please be careful. I hope they're able to find that monster. <sighs> huh? Goku! Hey! Are you feeling better? Yeah, I'm all better now. Oh, thank goodness! Sorry to worry you, Chi-Chi. And you too, Master Roshi. Huh. We're just glad you're better. By the way, it looks like everyone left. Are they after that cell guy? Uh, yeah, but how did you know about him? I heard everyone talking while I was asleep. I think I got the gist of what's going on. Oh. I think I've got a train too. You're going to fight? Uh, no way, you're in no shape to fight. You need more rest. Relax, guys. I'm not gonna fight anyone just yet. I mean, if Vegeta can't handle him, then there's no way I can. I'm gonna have to train and reach even higher levels. Higher than even Super Saiyan. Higher than Super uh, Saiyan? A level even higher than Super <laughs> Saiyan? Chi Chi, I, I wanna <laughs> take Gohan with me when I'm training. <laughs> Is that okay with you? So You're kidding, right? Super Saiyan. Oh, I guess there's nothing I can do to stop you if I say no. That's great. Fine. If you're going to train him, then make him strong. Thanks, Chi-Chi. But once the fight's over, it's straight back to his studies and nothing else, no matter what. And you're going to get a job. Damn. You got it. Thank you. All right, time to go. <laughs> she said you a deadbeat. <laughs> A flying if we approach Cell in this thing, we won't have to worry about him reading our power levels, don't you think? He's a crafty one. Even if we get close, we're still going to have to flush him out. 
Goku! Yo! How did you get here? Was it that instant transmission thing? Yep. You're back to 100% then? Yeah. But I'm kind of hungry. Hey, Camicolo! You don't Hello? have to combine our names. I'm mostly Piccolo, so just call me Piccolo. I hate to admit it, but I'm not powerful enough right now to take on the androids and that cell guy. But I think I've got an idea. I'm gonna take Gohan somewhere we can get a year's worth of training in one day. That's right. The hyperbolic time chamber, of course. Wait, no one has ever been able to last an entire year in there. Even you could barely last a whole month before. But things are different than before. We'll be fine. And don't forget, we can bring Vegeta and Trunks along with us. They'll be able to handle it for sure. Then get a move on. Cell's killing more and more people, and his power's growing every minute. Right. Goku, let me ask you something. Are you afraid we might be up against someone scarier than Frieza? Or are you happy about that? Both. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see that you're not giving up. There's that. Go on, let's go. We'll grab Vegeta and Trunks on the way. Okay. Where do you think Vegeta and Trunks are training? Let's see. I'm picking up some energy way over there. I'm guessing it might be them. Head towards the wasteland. Side quest, side quest, side quest. None. Bam, bam, bam. Vegeta's energy and trunks. Ah! Goku! So, how's your training going? Not very well. My father's treating me like an obstacle rather than a training partner. He's been like that for three days now. Just standing there. That's Vegeta for you. If I had to guess, I'd say he's probably thinking about how to go beyond Super Saiyan. Don't bother me, Kakarot. Get lost. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. I know a great place to train. It's called the Hyperbolic Time Chamber. You can get a year's worth of training there in just one day. It's up at Kami's Lookout. Are you serious? Seriously. Come with us. You don't have to train with me or anything if you don't want to. Just so you know, two people can use the room at once. So to save time, you're gonna have to go in with Trunks. Fine. But we're going in first. Got it. Sure. Yo, Loki. I used the room once before when I was a lot younger. It was beyond brutal in there. I could only stay in there for about a month. Perfect. That's exactly what I need. You're terrible. I'm Abba. Father, please let me train with you this time. I promise I oh, yeah, won't Sam hold Man you back. Out. Do whatever you want. a couple want. things I gotta watch. Man, you guys really don't get along, um, do you? Sandman. Uh, Grayman. Uncharted, I think, at least two. Huh. So, we'd like to train in the hyperbolic time chamber. Is that okay with you? Very well. This way. The room comes equipped with a bath, toilet, bed, and food. Good luck to you. Are you sure you want me to train harder, Kakarot? 
My end goal is to take you out after all. It's probably gonna take more than one of us to take this enemy down. Go forward knowing that, okay? In the future, you may very well regret this. If it's okay, we'll head in first. Good luck, guys! And play nice! Uh -huh. It's so hot. It's kind of hard to breathe, and the increased gravity makes it hard to move. And there's nothing here. It's just empty white space. Good. This is all I need. I... I have to spend a year in here with my father? <laughs> hey, Son of a bitch. you did want to train with me, didn't you? Then let's see what I'm dealing with. Show me what you've got. Huh? Right. No, I didn't, I didn't see the black phone. I'm not into, uh, the thrillers, really. Come at me, so full sure it's great. Don't hold back. Out of my face! Big Bang! Attack! Believe it! Good crap! Good This is it! One crap! Damn you! Oh shit! Believe it! Too slow! Just um like a weird Friday the 13th movie. Is this really your power? I better not find out you're going easy on me just because I'm your father. No, it's not that. It's just... Oh. No matter who your opponent is, you right, come at them as if this. you intend to kill them, understand? You are a member of the proud warrior race of Saiyans. And on top of that, royal blood runs oh. through your veins. My blood! I... I'm... not like you, father. <laughs> you coward. You're about to learn that nothing stands in my way. It looks like I found my next meal. I'm coming for you, Android 17 and 18. Once I gather enough energy from these filthy humans, I will absorb the both of you. <laughs> and then I will finally become the ultimate life form. <laughs> Soon, soon, I will be complete. Oh. <laughs> <Too much syrup>.
Oba. Almost a full day had passed since Vegeta and Trunks had entered the hyperbolic time chamber. The world is gripped with fear as the death toll has now reached several hundreds of thousands. There's no way that we're gonna find him. There's too many places for him to hide, you know? We're running out of time. Cell's powered himself up quite a bit already. Well, we might have to rely on Goku and the others for this. Let's just hope they can go beyond Super Saiyan. Hmm? What? Hey. Hmm? <laughs> Cell's fearsome evolution. Damn it. Why did it have to be now? Like, we have bigger so problems. So, is here? Goku here? He wasn't back at his place. So, we thought he might be hiding here. Just beat it, would you? You're not going to find Goku here. Oh, then tell us where we can find him. Do you honestly think we are just going to tell you? Your choice. You can either tell us, or we can make you. Fine by me. There's a deserted island not too far from here. We'll settle it there. Man, you guys aren't making this easy on yourselves. Sorry, but you're going to stay right here. You'd only be getting in the way. Get if I can manage to just take one of them out. Damn it. <laughs> only have two I have two dick medals. Not enough. That's not what I wanted at all. There we go. Where am I going? Over here. Wait, hold on. Was there a side quest that I was missing? shouldn't have made his way here yet. If there's one thing to be happy about, it's that Cell still hasn't absorbed those two yet. Hmm. Looks like someone wants to die. Now that I'm powered up thanks to my fusion with Kami, I might actually be able to do something. Hmm. Ain't gonna be able to Looks do like shit. someone wants to die. Uh, oh. Amazing. Ooh, the energy from this thing is incredible. That spot ought to do. There we go. What? Got nothing to say? Did that give me medals I'll by doing what I did? I'll just have to kill you That's then. Fine. <laughs> this isn't going to be as easy as you think. Well, come at me already. What, you're the only one that's gonna fight? Of course. Why not? I'm more than enough Open to handle book. you. This could work. I don't if even I know what I think even I just in the main menu, and I don't know what Cell won't get his perfect body. Let's go! Let's go! Things might go well as long as he doesn't figure out how to harden himself. Ow. Special beam cannon! Oh my god! Now for the finish! Finally show you your power! Special beam cannon! The punches don't have enough weight behind them. Like you a little bit cocky. Like you! Special beam cannon! Now for the finish, come it come, Tomert! Special beam cannon! You're no android, but you're pretty powerful. <laughs> 
We might be evenly matched in power, but when it comes to stamina, you've lost. I've got infinite energy reserves, after all. <laughs> Cell! Damn it! I was so focused on the fight, I didn't realize he was on his way here. I'm so pleased that this day has finally come. The day I absorb Android 17 and 18 will be the day I achieve my ultimate form! Well, shit. You powered yourself up this much? Damn it. Just how many victims have you gone through? Victims? That is such a short-sighted perspective. I prefer to call them donors. They're the ones I have to thank for my power, after all. Get out of here right now! He's going to absorb you, Seventeen! What? Absorb me? What are you talking about? I'll make it simple. That there is Cell, a monster that was created by Dr. Giroux's computer. But apparently is incomplete and needs to absorb you and Eighteen to achieve his <laughs> final form. What? Rejoice, my fellow head. Once I have absorbed you, your energy will feed my rise to true perfection. <laughs> I will finally evolve into what Dr. Giroux spent his life trying to achieve, the ultimate warrior! What are you talking about? You're looking at the ultimate warrior right here. Whether you desire it or not is irrelevant. You will be absorbed all the same. Having trouble shutting that mouth? Here, let me help. No! Get out of here, Seventeen! The enemy's power level far exceeds your own. <laughs> Jeez. You finally start talking. And you're just telling me to run away? Give me a break! Damn it! I forget how. I mean, the game will tell me. Yeah, you're but if kidding I remember me. correctly, only Cell's power level is through the roof. Seventeen and sixteen are killed. That's it, it isn't it? Cell? It's over. Remember. There's nothing we can do now. Krillin. Bulma's on the phone. Hello, Krillin? I figured it out. I know how to take the androids down. What? Really? Yeah. Androids 17 and 18 are equipped with emergency shutdown circuits. If you can activate those to immobilize them, they'll be sitting ducks. And I've already made a remote control that Call can the do that. Oh, thanks, Bulma. Can you bring that thing here? One step ahead of you. I'm already on my way and I'll be there soon. Awesome, you're the best! 
I'm going to go help Piccolo. I might not be able to do much, but it's better than doing nothing here. Your nose, Ian! Wait! Come back! There's nothing I can do. I feel so powerless. I sure do miss the days of being the world's greatest martial artist. Hey, Master Roshi, you're in Dragon Ball Fighters. You're fine. Sometime after CN made his way to Piccolo, Bulma's plane arrived at Comet. 